Right. Hello, everybody. Good evening. How are we all doing? It is Thursday... No, sorry, what? It is the 3rd of December, 2012. Don't ask me. Um, so, you may recall that roughly a couple of weeks ago, Warner Brothers um, were doing a, a countdown to the release of uh, The Dark Knight Rises in America, which is out tomorrow. It's already out here in the UK today, but it's released in... in, in in America tomorrow on Blu-ray and DVD, okay? So, in accordance to that, they decided to do a little reward kind of thing. Do a countdown for Dark Knight Rises, but then at the same time, you'll be helping out to unlock a reward for a Man of Steel exclusive. So, it went it went a bit nuts to begin with. Um, everybody shared it like crazy, to the point of where Warner Brothers thought, right, okay, they're sharing this too quickly, a lot, a lot quicker than we anticipated. We're going to need to tone it down a bit so they did um, and then as, as every day each day has gone on it's been unlocking and unlocking and it finally unlocked two nights or today even whatever you want to call it um, about half an hour or so ago and um, well if you haven't seen it just click on the link below and I will say I am not I'm not impressed we waited two weeks for that um, I know that the new trailer is coming out um, in about two weeks time I can't wait to see it because I will be going to see The Hobbit on the 13th of December so I am looking forward to that um, but this particular reward I was hoping it was something more tasty something more enticing something you know we could have had a glimpse of Zod maybe a glimpse of Krypton um, something on Smallville or Metropolis anything like that but what we get is a shot of Superman handcuffed being um, escorted by the military and the quality is what bugs me more than the actual you know what what the poster is of um, the quality it's just it's been taken from the Comic Con footage that they showed um, in San Diego in, in July and I look at it and I think how much money did you guys spend Hollywood, Warners, whoever you are, to come up with that poster. A five-year-old could have done better. Okay, that's what I'm ranting about. That's what I've been ranting on Twitter about for the past sort of 30, 40 minutes. You know, we waited two weeks, and that's what we get. Now, the poster itself does tell us a story. It tells us that, hopefully, you know, Superman gives himself up willingly to the military um, to not cause any major fuss to not think that he is above the humans, which in essence he is because he's a super powered alien. But anyway, um, you know, to to cooperate with them in some way. So we don't know the full story. We don't know the full extent as to why or how he's handcuffed. A lot of people are stating it's kryptonite, but if it was kryptonite, he wouldn't be walking to begin with. Um, so yeah, it, it 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 could there could be an ulterior motive. Maybe he's given himself up to I don't know help uh, take out Zod or something you know um, who knows but that's all well and good and I, I like that I get that so that's fine I can understand that concept of the poster the, the context rather but like I say it's the quality and just so anti anti anticlimactic basically very very anticlimactic it's just yeah um, but like I say overall it's good in terms of what it's saying what what it's teasing what it's hinting towards um but you know i really was hoping for more i really was so i am i am disappointed <clears throat> but i'll let it lie i will eventually live with it but um it's not really one of my favorite i'll say it's not one of my favorite posters that i've seen at all um but it has meaning I know that some people will say, oh, it's really great, it looks good. Well, okay, if you want to go for that, fine, not a problem. But then I've seen other comments and people noting down saying that, why, what, what is going on, what, is this what we wait for, this is what Warners give us, you know, and I'm feeling that like, like they are. But as I say, the flip side is, it does tell you, tell you what could potentially be occurring with Superman being in handcuffs. I mean, we've read it in the comics of him you know, giving himself up to, 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 
to, to the military and such. I mean, there have been some scuffles whereby the military want to arrest him, but then he flies off. But on this occasion, clearly Zack Snyder is thinking, right, we've got to turn that on his head. You know, rather than him fly away when he's when, when they want to arrest him, he's actually going to give himself up. But again, what is the reason why, on this occasion, does he does he decide he is going to get you know give himself up? So we'll see. We'll see how it plays out. I'm really looking forward to the trailers. I've already said, can't wait. 24, 2013 even is going to be very very interesting for me. So yes, I look forward to it. But like I say, I'm not not too pleased about the poster. I understand and I get what it is saying, but the quality is just shit. There you go. I've said it. Right. Thank you all very much. See you later.